Okay, City Council and Dipshit DCA, here's an example of your horse manure. At 52nd, there's a show called Jersey Boys. Most of the time, there's a police officer out front because the guys not only harass the people, they block the traffic and they overcharge to a high, high degree. We're talking high level degree. So, with that in mind, as we go by this theater, right, this clown would move. As we go by the theater, you're going to see an enormous amount of bikes, all illegals, all ripping people off, every one of them, because there's no police there today, and this is what you have allowed. This is your creation. This is your masterpiece of high-level destruction. That's right. And here we go on 52nd. And we see the bikes as we come up. Here, we just see the bikes blocking the street. Right? Every one of them charges three times the price of the old pre-regulation charges. Look at this shit. This is it. Yeah. Oh yeah, same guys, same bullshit. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you. It's all kind of amazing when you think about it. The show, yeah, I, I don't know. Hey, I don't really know how what that would do besides totally fuck up this business. Yep, totally fuck it up. We got scumbags, this show. This is what the fuck, this is Jersey Boys. Totally fuck it up. Yeah, that's 52nd Street. Yeah, 52nd Street. Yup, it's 52nd. Totally fucking it up. Totally. Totally fucking it up. Yeah. This is high level shit. High level. I mean, look at this shit. It is Jersey Boys, right? I'm coming down Fifth Avenue, north, one block of them. So, again, why are we doing this? Well, because I don't have a job anymore. My job. Was taken so students without they can't work at McDonald's. Are we clear on that one? But they can park their bikes on busy Fifth Avenue. And uh, when the police are in here, it says, Let's see what that says no standing. We got that on the thing right above Billy Elliot. No standing. That's what that sign says. And uh, a lot of traffic, huh? And I wonder if, um, and Mayor, with this traffic situation, we got the Penn Station, bikes, we got this regular Kazaki stand kid, right? Um, so cigarettes are a big deal right in front of them, right? It's not a big deal, I guess, the Mayor. So, we're just trying to reiterate, I'm not comfortable doing this, by the way. I wish I was, investigative reporting. I'm doing this because I've lost my job along with every other American and New Yorker. Now some of them get right off the bike and they solicit at the door. Right? That's the way to get a ride. In the old days, prior to the uh, admittance of any license in the world, there'd be three bikes sitting around the side, gently asking people when they came out. And now, I just have a little is this ain't a problem at all with traffic coming down Fifth Avenue, by the way? I was wondering if uh, that means anything, you know? Like, here's Fifth Avenue, right? That's Fifth Avenue. Right? And you got the traffic coming down, right? That's north on Fifth. And then you have the bikes. Right on Fifth Avenue. Right? Fifth Avenue. Hi, Fifth Avenue. 
right? And yeah, look at that. Okay, I'm a little nervous. So I'm going to circle around. There's one. Wow. And here is Empire State. Empire State, where there aren't supposed to be any bikes. And I, you see any Americans and New Yorkers here that used to do this job? I'm in American New Yorker, but I'm filming it. Why am I here filming it? Because the real Tea Party sh stuff is protesting losing your job to visiting students. Are they serving a function? Yeah, they're serving a function. They're blocking traffic. They're ripping off the public. And they're hanging out. I'm a little, uh, on Fifth Avenue where they... It's no big deal. And the, the officer... Let's have it. You know, God bless him. So if I go over there, I'd be concerned about getting a ticket. They don't really care if they get it. Is there a couple of bikes? I was just wondering if there were a couple of bikes at the Empire State, uh, Mr. Grodnick. Um, is this... Is this uh, supply and demand, uh, Mayor Bloomberg? Is this what we call supply and demand? Or is this what we call anything goes as long as you're from another country? And I'm over here, unable to work or make a living, unless I stoop to that level and get a ticket, right? I mean, and I, um, hey buddy, how you doing? So, I want to kick their asses, and, uh, what's up, man? See, my girlfriend's right upstairs. Yeah? You see these bikes here? I got a ticket here the other day. Right? Ah, oh, you got a ticket. That's right there. Sad. Yeah, right there. And a friend of mine got a ticket, too. And I got to go to court, right? I got to fight the fuck, I got to fight the ticket. Right? You know how much ticket was? You know how much ticket was? $250. Oh, yeah? Yeah. So, anyway, I'm pissed off. This fucking place. You know what I'm gonna do now? I'm gonna go jump off. You wanna film me? I'm gonna jump off the fucking building. You know, my. Empire State Building. And. A friend of mine, Pedicare Driver, got a ticket in February being the only bike at the Empire State Building. Now. As I cross 34th Street, July 2nd, as you're coming down 5th Avenue, these cars are flying. At 5th Avenue, where they're not supposed to be, the law states there aren't supposed to be any pedicabs. Um, as you see, we'll uh, cross the street, and you, and you tell me what's wrong with this picture, okay? Because um, this one gentleman is a pedicab driver from who knows where, just arrived, student, which the federal law says pedicab students, can, J1 visas cannot be pedicab drivers. My problem with this is it's forced, all, it's, well, it's, let's just observe. And here's the police who are supposed to ticket. It's a beautiful thing, right? Now they're all here, right? They're all here. And every one of them, right? This is Empire State Building. Right in front of the Empire State Building right here. Right? Empire State. Right? Right? So we got the policeman right here. And we got we have all these pedicabs, right? All these fucking pedicabs. We got this fucking guy right there. Right? So we have a lot of them, right? And then we'll come around the corner. Are there any more? This is J1 visas, right? At, at the Empire State Building. J1 visas. Tell me if you think that is a good thing. And let's see. Uh, we have a one loan pedicab that's got a ride. And uh, in the old days, there'd be four bikes. Right there. All right. This guy. I wonder where he's from. Wherever he's from, he's ringing his bell unnecessarily. And, and, uh, so, that's the deal. All right? Okay. I'll see you later. I love you. No, I don't.
I'm pretending that I'm talking to someone. You know, it's pretty uncomfortable to film this. All right.